everybody. Thanks for joining us. I assume, Moses, the mic, is it on? Okay. <laughs> everybody, thanks for joining us. This is uh, great to be here in this special building, in this special spot on this warm night. And um, shout out to Ron and Jody. Thank you for being here and commenting on our stream. Uh, those first three selections were um, from Carmen. And we have um, a few pop tunes coming up uh, for you, and as well as some movie tunes. So stay tuned. Please share if you can. <laughs> Thank you.
taking a small break for a minute or two. And we're moving on to some movie music. So you can um, shout out and see if you can guess what we're playing or let us know whether you're enjoying it. Also want to give a shout out to um, Bitter Housewife that um, has graciously donated to our um, concerts and she has bitters available at New Seasons and Market of Choice. Um, and she's a great gal and uh, we're really thankful for her support. And also to Daryl Hanks Bowmaker, if any of you students or professionals want a bow made, um, Daryl will be happy to make one for you and he's got a small selection of bows for sale as well. Dieter likes to make you guess what we're playing. <laughs> but I know we've gotten some requests to tell you what we're playing. So the last two were Scarborough Fair um, and uh, Fields of Gold. Thank you. 
Stranger Things, that's right. <laughs> awesome. Oh, nice. Joanne says she just got some bitters from Hollywood Beverage. Great. <laughs> microphone okay so bill Britton guest stranger things yes bill ding ding good job <laughs> and then i see that of course zach hudson guessed the songs not surprised he's an encyclopedia <laughs> and um hi to joanne and hi to mom carol and hi to josh killingsworth and he says the pizzicato was cool awesome glad you liked it to the character on Stranger Things. Oh, her, right. 11. <laughs> Suddenly got a craving for some Eggo waffles. We try. <laughs> um, Mary's is out of Africa. Oh, good guess, Mary, but no. I'll let Dieter explain. <laughs> Legends of the Fall, Brad Pitt, and um, 
Anthony Hopkins and Julia Armand, I think. Yeah, another discussion. But. Wait, what? <laughs> We're waiting for the geeks to come out of the woodwork and say that they knew what that was. <laughs> come on, Bill. We're heading into the classical portion of the program, so we're going to play a few recognizable songs first, um, hopefully recognizable, and then some more uh, popular um, things by Bach and Vivaldi. So, and Erin's just looking for her music, which I think she'll find.
I wanted to dedicate this next one to um, all the families and folks out there that have lost um, a loved one in the last uh, year, year and four months while we've been in this um, COVID situation. Thanks.
thing to say? Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sure. Kelly can come up. Do you want to say something? Okay. Just taking a slight break. Um, and feel free to put some money in the tip jar. I think our Venmo and PayPal addresses are there. And um, this next one we're going to be playing is a Bakshikan arrangement for cello. And uh, just be forewarned, it's a little bit longer. So it's about nine, nine and a half. So it's a little bit longer than normal, but it's. Um, Really a great arrangement and a great tribute to um, how brilliant Bach is. I want to send a shout out to our manager, Kelly Vanderzand, and she is a wonderful person and uh, thank her for how much help she has given us. So we'll be starting here in a few seconds. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for joining us for the live stream of Poor Cellos. A reminder that these musicians are working for your tips and your tips alone. So please consider throwing some money in one to the digital tip jars if you're enjoying this music. It is literally how we are keeping this music alive during this crazy time. But 20 bucks or more will get you a chance to win tonight's raffle of incredible prizes, including some bitters from the bitter. Help me out, Dieter. What's the, what's the bitter? The bitters? The Bitter Housewife, that's right. Um, uh, an incredible prize package, and uh, we're so happy to be providing these prizes for you today. A reminder to throw some money in a tip jar, smash that share button. Thank you so much for joining Porcello's here live, coming at you from the atrium of Montgomery Park. And now, yes. some more music from really Porcello's.
nice to hear from you. Thanks for tuning in. Um, I also see one of my current students and probably one of Porcello's biggest fans is here, Mika. And um, my brother has joined. He's super late, so he missed the two pieces that I dedicated to him. Just kidding, Ryan. Um, but we did, we played um, something earlier that some people said that it sounded familiar, but they didn't know what it was. And um, if, in case you were wondering, that was the theme from The Mandalorian. Bill. The next selection we're doing is a pretty famous one for cellos. Um, I'll just say that we're just doing two selections tonight, um, but the Adagio and the Allegro from Concerto for two cellos in G minor. And we're thrilled to have Clint um, bouncing out harmonically and bass, and he's just a fabulous bass player, so we're thrilled to have him.
drink of water and fanning each other because it's a little bit warm in here. But thank you to uh, Brandy Stinnett, who is, um, I think, the manager here at the building for allowing us to be here in this fabulous facility on this uh, great night in Portland. We just have a couple more selections for you, and I'll let Erin talk a little bit about the next one after she takes a drink of her vodka. <laughs> Actually, it's just water. <laughs> Don't tease me. <laughs> well, this is um, turning out to be one of our signature pieces, which is great with me. And um, I know Kelly is also a Nine Inch Nails fan, so yeah, she gives me the two thumbs up. So future projects include um, doing an entire album Pretty Hate Machine, that's on my to-do list, or my wish list for poor cello, so um, give us a thumbs up if you agree that Nine Inch Nails on cello is awesome.
Just have one more selection for you tonight. Thanks again for coming. I really appreciate your support and just for being here and for chiming in and for coming to past concerts. And we'll be doing some more. We'll keep everybody informed. And if you want to be on Instagram, our Instagram um, address is at Porcellos. So, and then Aaron. Um, hi, Stacy. It's a fellow. Um, mom, school mom. <laughs> um, I just want to say, just have the image in your mind of our three-year-old daughter who, as you can imagine, gets a sh her share of musical experiences. And um, she's a particular fan of 80s music. I don't know why. Um, but earlier today, she was dancing while we rehearsed this one. She loves this one.